Assalamu alaikum my name is Ibrahim Zafar and you are watching book summary series by Orbit Group of Colleges The book which we are bringing forward today is Who Will Cry When You Die by Robin Sharma Who Will Cry When You Die helps you leave a lasting legacy of greatness after you are gone by giving specific tips on how to become the best version of yourself and the kind that makes others grateful for all of your contributions to their lives and the world Life keeps moving at a faster pace every day. We are always connected through our devices. There are constantly new ideas and emails and all sorts of things for us to follow and learn from. Somewhere in the mix of all this, however, we have begun to struggle with finding meaning in life. It's great to improve ourselves, but we have to remember that we are not doing this just for our own benefit. The impact we can have on the world is only as good as how much we influence the lives of others for the better. That's just what Robin Sharma, the author of The Monk Who Sold His Ferrari, teaches us about in his book Who Will Cry When You Die. Life lessons from the monk who sold his Ferrari. If you're looking to reconnect with your purpose and make a difference for the better in the world, this is the book for you. Here are just 3 of the many great life lessons I have learned from this book. Number 1, being honest and knowing how to put the failure into perspective will help you to be happier. Number 2, limiting children and taking care of your body are two great ways to rediscover the joy in life. And number 3, stop complaining by adopting a more proactive mindset and looking more at what you can contribute than what's wrong. What do you know more about what people will think of you after you're gone because we are about to find out how to have a meaningful life. I really enjoyed Who Will Cry When You Die for a lot of different reasons. The advice it gives makes me feel good and motivated to become a better person and have a better life. It's a great reminder of how to take the insignificant worries out of living and truly have a life that you love and that others do too. Winding up with these motivational words of Robin Sharma. I wept because I had no shoes until I saw a man who had no feet. Thanks for watching. Allah Hafiz.